Hi everyone. Today I am going to discuss about important concepts on electrostatic potential and capacitance and current electricity. If you prepare these two chapters completely, then easily you will get 25 marks in your second PUC annual exam 2023 and 24. Before that, those who are watching my videos first time, do like and subscribe for more updates. First, I will go through the electrostatic potential and capacitance chapter. Here, in this chapter, the total allotted hours is 12 hours and allotted marks is 11 marks. Okay. This 11 mark is distributed in several sections. First one is MCQ. From this chapter, you will get one MCQ question which carries one mark and one essay type question which carries three mark and one NP numerical problem which carries two mark means problem is of short type okay next one long answer which carries five mark totally 11 mark from this chapter now I will uh, go through the important concepts on the electrostatic potential and capacitance these are the important concepts from this chapter first one is electrostatic potential second one equipotential surface third one relation between electric field and potential next potential energy of a system of charges next potential energy in an external field next one electrostatic of conductors next one seventh one parallel plate capacitor this is important for three mark derivation next one parallel plate capacitor with dielectric this is also important for three mark type question and combination of capacitors series combination parallel combination this is also most important concept in this chapter if you prepare all these nine concepts easily you will get 11 mark from this chapter okay next i will go through the next chapter current electricity this is the one of the biggest chapter in second puc physics here from current electricity you have more contribution in your annual exam compared to other chapters from this chapter the total teaching hours is 15 hours and total allotted mark is 14 mark this 14 mark is distributed in several sections here this is a one of the chapter only one chapter in which you are getting two five mark questions one is from derivation section long answer and the one is numerical problems okay ah. here mcq one question essay type question three mark question and long answer one derivation and one problem okay totally 14 mark next moving to the important concepts first one is ohm's law okay you will get question on ohm's law next one second one drift velocity of electrons here you may get derivation of drift velocity it may ask for three mark or five mark next mobility next one cells in series and parallel combinations this is also one of the important concept in this chapter here there may be a possibility of getting five mark question here i have the expression for cells in series combination this is one question 
and in the type obtain the expressions for cells in parallel combination this is also separate question on cells concept there are two derivations in series combination and other one is parallel combination five mark type derivation next one is kirchhoff's loose okay here there are two rules are there next one important concept we stone bridge from this concept you are going to get five mark derivation you have to draw the diagram and uh, mention the arrow mark in diagram and you have to obtain the ex expressions and you have to balance the that uh, condition okay. next one is emf and internal resistance okay. these are the main concepts in this chapter if you prepare these chapters then easily you will get the allotted marks from these two chapter if you prepare completely you will get 25 marks from these two chapters okay thank you